Are you riding with the Crimson Tide? Do you think the Hurricanes are gonna bring the pain? Or the Friars are gonna get fried? The American Gaming Association predicts 68 million Americans will gamble on March Madness this year. That's up 45 million from 2022. It's fun. There's excitement attached to it. You feel like you're involved in the game, especially sports gambling, in a way that you're not if you're just watching. Now, Suzanne Deggs White, a counseling professor and chair of the counseling department at Northern Illinois University, says a sports gambling addiction is one of the easiest addictions to get. It's such a natural thing to get excited about the outcome. Humans are competitive. We like to feel like a part of the action. So here's some tips to stop that gambling itch. Number one. Set yourself a money limit and stick to it. Number two, walk away from your losses. Don't just bet more to lose more. Number three, think of it as entertainment, not a way to make money. If you equate it to a night out on the town, it doesn't seem as bad when you lose it. And number four, accept the odds. Most of us will want Howard University to beat down on Kansas, but they just might not do it. So if you do get addicted to gambling here in Illinois, here's the gambling hotline for you. You can also text I-L-G-A-M-B to this number right here. Happy March Madness, everyone.